Better to be judged by 12 than carried by six. Longtime actor and CBS Training Day star Bill Paxton is dead after complications from surgery. Good evening. I'm Lena Wynn in for Elsa Ramon. And I'm Peter Doubt. A day of celebration and mourning for Hollywood. The sudden passing of Bill Paxton is on the minds of many on the film industry's biggest night. CBS 2's Greg Mills is live in the Hollywood Hills with the reaction on the death of Paxton. Greg. Lena and Peter, this was just stunning to both Hollywood and the fans. And to go at the age of 61, people just couldn't believe it. We hunt the city's most dangerous game. Bill Paxton was starring in a new CBS series. His career still going strong. He died suddenly at the age of 61. Complications following surgery. That's very sad. Very sad. Fans in Hollywood for the Academy Awards were shocked by the news. <gasps> he passed away. I didn't even know. Oh, no. Oh, my gosh. That's six, so sad. Six, Rob Lowe tweeted, he was devastated by the sudden loss of my close friend and one of the finest actors in the business. He's in like all of our favorite movies, like True Lies and um, Apollo 13. Probably Apollo 13. A number of fans mentioned another big starring role. Maybe Twister. Rabbit, you know any shortcuts? Twister, storm chasing Bill Paxton and Helen Hunt. True Lies star Arnold Schwarzenegger tweeted, Bill Paxton could play any role, but he was best at playing Bill. A great human being with a big heart. Paxton stopped by our CBS2 KCAL 9 studios a few weeks ago to talk about his new CBS series, Training Day. This isn't a training day, it's a trial by fire. Paxton's co star, Justin Cornwell, tweeted, We were just two guys on top of the world. Rest easy, my friend. A CBS and Warner Brothers statement remembered Paxton as a guy who lit up every room with infectious charm, energy, and warmth and is a great storyteller who loved to share entertaining anecdotes and stories about his work. A family representative wrote, Bill's passion for the arts was felt by all who knew him, and his warmth and tireless energy were undeniable. Paxton and his wife Louise were married for 30 years and had two children. He left Texas for Los Angeles at the age of 18 and enjoyed success for decades in movies and on TV. He was also a serious actor and he was always played like really funny ones too. Good in everything. Uh that he played. I just enjoyed him as an actor. A room full of innocent bystanders. That's only a problem if you miss. A CBS wrapped up a shooting training day in December. There are nine episodes left. You can see uh, the first of those nine coming up this Thursday night right here on CBS2. Lena, Peter, back to you.